Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 7th of September 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, I've got a few things to do today, uh, but now seems an opportune time to uh, play the New York Times hard level Sudoku Puzzle. Let's hope it doesn't go on for too long. Um, I'm sure you think that every time. <laughs> Please don't make this go on any longer. I'm sure I hear you say. <laughs> um, let's uh, see what's going on in the world. Oh, yeah. I live in a country where English is not particularly... Good English is not particularly prevalent, I must say. I mean, some people can speak English very well. Uh, the majority of the population has a smattering of English, but that's about as far as it goes. So uh, often I have to explain the differences between British English and American English. And these don't really amount to much to be honest with you words you know like lift and elevator and sidewalk and pavement are well known um, and uh, I think pretty easily understandable one Americanism that really drives me crazy there I, <laughs> I quite like American English to be nice with you I think it's quite nice but there is one Americanism that drives me crazy and that is the pronunciation of the word boy and I'm not talking about boy I'm talking about b u o y um which Americans somehow pronounce as buoy, which seems to me absolutely ridiculous. I know it's spelt B-U-O-Y, but it, how can it be pronounced like that? Because we have words like buoyant, right? The adjective buoyant, and we have buoyancy as a noun. What do they say? Buoyant? Bu bu buoyancy? It seems ridiculous to me. Anyway, there you go, Americans. Take on a British English pronunciation of that word. I know they think it's weird because it sounds the same as boy. But uh, why am I mentioning? Oh, yeah, boys in Rio Grande have been deemed uh, as unconstitutional, I think, or illegal or something like that. Uh, boys that are there to try to stop Mexicans uh, crossing into uh, the U.S., um, have been deemed very unfriendly and told to be um, removed. So well done, uh, that judge. Uh, let's go on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Um, New York Times, I can see something. I see the two blocking down here and a two across there. So I am going to say, let's put a two into that square there. And I can definitely see the six and the two up here, which is going to put six and two into these squares down here now what does that mean six and two so we've got eight blocking across here so eight's going to be in one of those squares blocking up there that has to be an eight doesn't it and eights will be up here so we've got six and two here so we're going to have five eight and nine up here we've got five and eight the rest of we don't know about down here we're looking for uh, well, five and nine for sure. Five and nine across here. So this is going to be five. Oh, no, we've got we can do better than that. <laughs> I never look a bit further, do I? Nine in that square there. Five blocking here. And now I can finally find out what the missing number is because I didn't even check. Six, isn't it? All right. Uh-huh. Okay, we have three blocking this square, and we have three blocking this square, so that's going to be a three in this column. We will be left with one five, I guess. On the topic of fives, I've just seen five blocking across. I haven't been. I haven't tried to find any kind of easy ones yet. I just started with something and got involved in it. Okay, so we've got five blocking like this. So we've got fives in one of these squares blocking this way. Five across here. Five down and five down. Let's say, hey, you're a five.
Okay, we have two going upwards and a two across here. So there's a two. And now I think maybe we'll hit on the digits individually and see if we spot anything. Ah, uh, seven. Okay, this is a pair of seven and four. We got seven and four in these columns up here. So we've got seven and four there. Uh, so I should be able to get this number because I think I worked this out as yeah six and two, didn't I? And now I can work out what goes here. So I can definitely place this. Now this is seven and four. So this is one, three, one, three, eight. One three eight two six. Um, then this is going to be our five, isn't it? And this will be a one up here now. And the three and the eight block here. So this is going to be three and eight. And so this will be our one. Ah, now if I think, yes, we've got one across here and one up here. So one in one of these squares blocking down and down here and across there. So we can say here's a digit one. Well, I, uh, okay, we've got three, eight, six, nine. Oh, no. Yes, three, eight, six, nine missing here, right? Three, three, eight, six, nine. Yes, we've got nine blocking here and here and here. There's our nine. Now we've got six blocking here and here, so there's our six. We've got eight blocking this square, so that's going to be our eight, and then this is going to be our three. <clears throat> Uh, okay, we've got eight blocking these three squares, so that's our eight down here. 
We also have eight across here and eight down here. So there's an eight. Um, two blocking here and here. So there's two in that column. And we're left with what? One seven up here. Uh, I want to look at this row here because I thought that I spotted something here, but I could be wrong. Let's see what we're looking for here in this row. Uh, we're looking for four, six, seven, eight. Yes. So four and eight block this square. Oh, no, 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 no. Eight blocks here. So no, that's that's our eight but four could actually be in any of those squares I made a mistake there oh but wait a minute we've got six no no we don't no we don't no we don't forget that I'm taking you nowhere fellow Sudokans ignore my instructions or directions or whatever they are Ah, what I can say is this is 1 and 7 up here right now. We've got 4 and 6 blocking this square. We need 4 and 6 in this column, so that's got to be 4 and 6. So this is our last number, which will be 9. If this is 1, 7, 4, 6 over here, that's got to be a 9, hasn't it? Okay, 9 blocking down here, 9 across there. There's a 9 we can place. Ah, uh, what are we left with? 2, 7 here, is it? Ah, so two blocks here. So that's a two. This can't be two. That must be two. This must be seven. Seven blocking up here will give us a seven in that square. Two across here and across here means there's our two. Three blocking across here puts a three in that square. And we'll finish this block with a six. Yeehaw, we need a six for this row as well. That will give me sixes like this. Sixes are here. Okay, we've got six up here and six across there. So we can also place a six there. And we can finish this with something. Is it a four? I think it is. Four blocking across here and up here there's a four we can place. Uh, this we knew was something I got. Uh, was it? I've forgotten what it was. Was it six and two? I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah, six. Oh, actually, now we can get the two anyway. Look, two across there. So there's our two. And yeah, the six blocking down there. There's our six. Okay. So the missing number here now is going to be a 3. And there's one number missing up here. And that's the space reserved for a 7. 7 blocks across here. Here's our 7. The missing number here is a 1. Um, 5, 8, 9, 5, 8, 9. Okay, we'll forget that. Let's look somewhere else. This looks like it might be friendly. Uh, we're looking for one, we're looking for four, and we're looking for seven. We have four and seven here, so this is going to be a one. <coughs> seven blocks this square. There's our seven, and then a four. We'll finish this column. Uh, one number to get here. Is it a three? I think it is. Okay, so three blocks up here and three across here and across here will give us three in that square. Nine blocking all the way up here. We need a nine in the top row. It must be in that position. This will be a five. And we also have five blocking across here, so that gives me a five there. And we can finish this with an eight. Missing numbers here are... One and 
9 so we got our 9 up here there's our 9 there's our 1 let's take that one to the bottom here one across here there's our 1 the last number to place here is 7 7 blocking up here there's a 7 the missing number here is an 8 8 blocks down here giving me the final 8 there the missing number here is a 4 I think if I can hit the right key 4 blocking down here there's a 4 and we finish with a 6 so again like yesterday uh, pretty straightforward um, New York Times after several days of uh, hard stuff see you around bye bye